Hey guys, today I'm teaching you how to apply bow and arrow. It's a weed killer, safe to use across Kaiku, Buffalo, and Cooch lawns. And I'm gonna teach you how to take care of all your flat weeds in it with no fuss and hassle. So what we got here, this is my canvas for today. It's a Queensland blue Cooch lawn with lots of flat weeds in it. This bow and arrow is gonna clean up all of that bindi, all of that cud weed, the dandelion, um, the clover and all sorts. How we're gonna achieve that. Today I'm gonna to just do it with um, a five litre sprayer. Today it will be the Nilex sprayer. Um, the most important thing to do is to apply products with this nozzle. It means that the um, product will stick to the leaf because of its droplet size and you should get a really good kill with it. So first things first, when, um, when spraying out on the product, the first thing first is to work out how big your area is. And then what you should do is you should fill up your sprayer to the top and work out and spray across your lawn with water first. Um, test it with water on a different day to the day you're spraying and work out how much water you use across your area. Once you've worked out, this is an example, today I just sprayed across this lawn and I worked out that I used three litres across it. I then worked out the area which is 80 square metres. So to cover that 80 square metres I need three litres of water. I now can put in my bow and arrow, and the rate for bow and arrow is 50 mil per 100 square meters. So for this lawn, I need 40 mil of product in my three liters of water to achieve a 99 to 100% success rate with my product. So a couple things, PPE, you're gonna need gloves, you're gonna need long pants, you're gonna need to wait till the leaf dries. It's best to apply this stuff five days after a mower when the leaf's at its biggest, the weed's at its biggest, um, and then wait a couple of days before you cut it again. Definitely if you've got kids or dogs or animals, keep the pets and the kids off the um, lawn until the products dry on the leaf. So that's how we're gonna do it. 